We need more jobs. We've all heard people say it, and maybe we've even said it ourselves. We ask and cry and yell for the next big manufacturing plant to sweep in and save our cities in transition. We call on our local governments to woo a Goliath company to our region with incentives because, above all else, we need to get back to work in order to move forward, right? Well, it's partially right, but here's the reality. Asking for jobs to drop from the heavens into your community is sort of like walking into a job interview in jeans and a cheap t-shirt. It's like digging an area for a garden and expecting plants to grow without seeds. Or it's like going on a first date and expecting someone to fall in love with you even though you have absolutely nothing interesting to offer. Like a garden needs the right elements to grow, or like a partner needs to know you're someone with a multitude of positives. Jobs are grown from community members who invest themselves in cultivating the components that make a happy, healthy population. One of the keys to this is an urban-centered, pro-local business approach. This really helps to build a strong foundation around which local residents can rally. Outside employers and investors today are looking for communities with a business-friendly environment, as well as communities that are alive and thriving with a strong urban center and plenty of interesting things to do. Big businesses are given incentives to create jobs wherever they go, but what they're really looking for is a happy workforce and an already thriving community. The truth is, the greatest cities, like a magnificent garden, are grown. The arts, nightlife, entertainment, and even local retail are the soil, rain, and fertilizer that make all the difference. Something I hear so often is, why are we spending money on bike lanes or better sidewalks? We need local jobs. People who know how cities and communities work know that this is kind of like saying, why should I water my garden? We need to invest in more plants. If you really want new jobs, it's vitally important to invest in the elements that lead to a happy, healthy city. Sometimes the impact of these elements are a little hard to see, but they're there and they work. We have a wealth of data now that shows us exactly what it is that builds strong communities that are major job producers for its residents. So next time you hear someone rant about spending on local quality of life developments in lieu of investing in jobs, tell them, hey, we're just growing a better garden. We're building a stronger relationship. We're creating a happier, healthier workforce poised and determined to succeed. The sooner we accept that jobs are grown from healthy, thriving communities and not the other way around, the sooner we'll all be able to take the biggest steps into a better tomorrow for our American cities. Thanks for listening. Now go out and tend to that beautiful urban garden of yours. Take care.